RegOnline enables you to analyze any aspect of your event, from registrants to lodging and travel coordination to event revenue. Here I have an event called Lanyon Live 2016 that I have activated already to take registrations. To track registrations, RegOnline provides a set of standard reports, like this registrant list, for example. It provides details about all the registrants, including personal information, as well as payment and status of attendance. But this standard report may not fully meet your needs. Let's say you want to be able to view registrants by payment method. We'll create a custom report to get to this information. We put a unique name for the report. I don't want to see row number, so I'll uncheck this, but I do want to see the summation row so I can see total charges and balance due. You can decide what format you want to view the report in. I'll keep it in HTML since I don't need to do additional analysis on it. I can choose fields from the standard set, custom, event fee and agenda items, or merchandise if those apply to my event. In this case, I'm choosing the same set of fields that are used in the standard registrant list report. I simply click on the field and click on the arrow to move it into my field choices. And I do that for each of the fields that I want to include. I have two custom fields that I want to include. I want to show them immediately after the company, so I simply click on them and use the Move Up button to move them into place. RegOnline provides a number of filters. We'll choose a preset date of last month and limit it only to those who are confirmed to attend the event. And you can create multiple custom filters. In this case, we'll only include those who have a country equal to the United States. RegOnline lets you group the content in the report. In our case, we want it by payment method. And then we can sort by registration date and descending so that those who most recently registered are shown at the top. RegOnline provides smart link capability so that you can easily share the report with event stakeholders. You can include a password for added security and choose the format that you want the recipients to see the report in. And then we simply run the report. You can see now that we have the same registrant list report but have it grouped by payment method and then within each group, ordered by the date descending of their registration date. That's how you can use custom reports to track the success of your event using RegOnline.